multi-store clearance haul for you guys today hi guys and thank you so much for watching my videos if you are new to my channel welcome please consider hitting that like subscribe and notification bell so you never miss an episode so i have a pretty decent size clearance haul for you guys i got stuff from aldi i did go to the 99 cent only store i didn't buy a whole bunch but i want to share with you guys those deals there were some pretty decent deals so i grabbed some stuff at the 99 i also have some walgreens 90 percent off clearance for you guys and more and then after this i'm going to film my dollar tree haul for the week so and i have some really nosy puppies look at them see that they're looking for cookies. They're looking for toys. They heard the magic word cookies. Looking for toys or looking for anything that they think belongs to them because my dogs are super nosy. <laughs> so um, we're going to go ahead and get started with this haul. I'm super excited to share it with you guys. So guys, I definitely, I wanted to share what I got at Daiso really quickly because I forgot I had some Daiso Japan stuff. If you have not seen my Daiso, which is a Japanese dollar store and they have a lot of Disney and Hello Kitty items. They also have like some really unique finds. So if you have not checked out that walkthrough, it's in the description box if you guys want to check it out. But um, I love looking at their Hello Kitty items as well as their Disney items. So I have a friend, a very, very good friend, and she is obsessed with, well, she's not, I guess she is kind of obsessed with Winnie the Pooh. So I picked this up for her. I thought she can either put her makeup brushes in here or her colored pencils when she colors and it's Winnie the Pooh. You're going to love this. So I got this for her. Um, this was $1.75 unless otherwise marked. Um, everything at Daiso Japan is $1.75. So a Disney merchandise. It has the Disney logo on the back. Something like this in Anaheim Disney area is probably going to run you about $8.99. No joke. It's so expensive. And then they have actual Sanrio merchandise there at um, Daiso as well. So I got this adorable little Hello Kitty tin and I actually got this for my goddaughter because she is obsessed with Hello Kitty and I'm going to be making her like a Hello Kitty um, stocking for Christmas. So I'm gathering stuff now. So then when Christmas time comes, I can just go ahead and give her that stocking. So and I might, I'm hoping I can find a Hello Kitty like blanket as well. And then they also had the Hello Kitty stickers. You do get four pages and it does have the Sanrio logo in the back. So you know, it's genuine Hello Kitty merchandise. You get 295 cute, adorable stickers for a buck 75. And she loves stickers. She loves, she loves everything. So I grabbed her this as well. I thought that was cute. And then the last thing I grabbed for her was this adorable Hello Kitty jumbo pencil with a sharpener guys. And these were $1.75 as well. She is in school and I thought, you know, this is going to fit perfectly in her um, stocking and it has a sharpener. The one thing I hated about these pencils when I was a kid is we can never sharpen them. So I'm glad that they are including the sharpener. Once again, it is a Sanrio merchandise. You can see with the back $1.75. That is a great deal. So that's everything I got at Daiso Japan. Let me go ahead and grab another bag before these dogs <laughs> attack these other bags and we will continue. Nosy, nosy puppies. Okay. At Aldi, they had this little set here and they were putting these out and I didn't realize these were going to be marked down. So I was super excited when I found it. I thought this is going to make, let me see if I can find the front, an amazing, like a little gift. I'll show you guys in a second. It was $3.99. Okay, so first of all, you guys definitely keep your eyes peeled for this. You have your little stickers that go with it. So it says um, cotton swabs, cotton pads, hand soap, dish soap toothbrushes and cotton balls so that's what it comes with those and then you also get the little twine which I thought was really cute you get a uh, pump dispenser for your um, soap and then look it comes in these adorable mason jars so you get one for the soap which is so cute guys I mean, I'm not sh exactly sure how this goes, but super cute. And then you also get, you get four pieces with this. You get the little toothbrush holder. Oh, here's a little thing that goes with the soap pump. So you get a little toothbrush holder. It's very vintagey looking. That's why I really, really liked it. 
And with the twine and everything put together, I think this is going to be a really, really cute little raffle gift. Um, I would totally put it... I don't know. Let's, let me know, guys. Post a comment. Let me know because I do have the box and the box is... Um, what's that thing called? It does have... Um, foam but I'm just so nervous that it's going to break in shipping because it is glass. And I'm not exactly sure how this goes but I do think this is adorable. Little mason jar. So yeah I got to figure out how this goes but super cute on that. And then the little toothbrush and then you also get two jars. So you get one. Oh this is so cute. You get one and it could either be for the cotton swabs or your um cotton pads or your q-tips right oh does this go like this oh it does okay there we go that makes sense see there's a little piece right here and you just click it in i can i'm not gonna mess it up but yeah it all came together so i'm excited about that because i'm like that looks kind of hokey okay and then you get another little jar too as well so cute little set for $3.99. It's like getting them all at 99 cents a piece, which I think is great. And it is glass guys. So super pretty jars. So I'm going to make a little gift out of that. And then I love the twine that goes around it. And then you can put your little stickers and the stickers are already pre printed for you and they look like chalkboard. So I think that's going to be like a really cute little farmhouse raffle gift I'm going to put together. I only got one more other thing at um, Aldi, which were these metal bins. Um, I thought it'd be great to put some of the shreds in it and then make some raffle gifts out of. And these were on clearance. These are the stackable storage bins by Huntington Home. These were on clearance for $2.49. So I went ahead and grabbed two of those. So that is everything that I got at Aldi. Let me go ahead and grab my Walgreens bags and we will continue. So definitely check your Walgreens toys area. Some places they just didn't mark them down. They're still sitting there and they still may ring up for 90% off. So definitely check. I got two packages of highlighters. I got one for my friend. Um, she had asked me for highlighters and I'm like, yeah, I'll pick them up at the Dollar Tree. And then I found them at... Um, Walgreens, and these are by ZR. I've never heard of this brand. Highlighting fluorescence. You get these beautiful colors. I grabbed one for myself and one for her. Um, these were only 10 cents. So I had to grab them for 10 cents. And then some great toys you can pick up, guys. I had the Kids Scavenger. This was only $1.49. They had the Paint Your Own Sun Scatchers for 89 cents. They also had these adorable mom cups, and these are great, and these are by Modern Expressions. Um, these were $12.99. They were only $8.29, so grabbed two. Sorry about that. Grab two. And then they also had the paint by numbers, and this was another... Um, 89 cents for this one and it's by Playwright which I thought was a great deal and then Megan grabbed me some items let me grab that and I also want to show you something else Megan found at Rite Aid at 90% off so I'm excited to share that with you guys because Megan when she can she'll grab toys for me money save you Megan when she can she drives grabs toys for me and then I hold on to them for my toy drive and she's like that's like my contribution and I'm like no girl you volunteer you're like helping me set up break down hand out toys like you don't have to do all that but she just feels like she has to I really don't ask her to but it's so sweet when she does so let me show you what she got me and I'll be right back so Megan, 90% off Walgreens. She always finds like the best toys. Her Walgreens is not always, has a lot more merchandise than mine did and it was not marked. And the only thing I wish Walgreens has was its own scanner, like how CVS does, like how Michaels does. Like it's just so much more convenient to go to the scanner than going to the register. Because sometimes the register is full or the cashiers are like, oh no, it's not 90% off. And then they're like, no, not at all. And they're putting it behind the register when it really is, you know, stuff like that. Had that happen to me a few times. She did find the Lego Friends for 99 cents. Great gift. People love Legos. Like they're hugely popular. So she found that. And then she also found this Play-Doh 
um, little set for 89 cents. This is the Play-Doh. I don't know what the name is. It's like a little mouth and you can like practice brushing your teeth or put braces on it. So funny. I wish I had a name. Let's see. Mini Doctor. Doctor and Phil. Mini Dentist. <laughs> How cute is that? This was 89 cents. Super cute. And then she got this one too for 99 cents. Which is by Play-Doh as well. This is the um, Making Faces Play-Doh. And you get 20 pieces. Great deal. And then she also got the Paint by Numbers as like I did. So these are great. These are great for Easter baskets. So these will go into my Easter basket section. Um, and this one as well. Great, great deal on those. So I got a ton of Easter stuff. Like Easter is going to be on point this year. I don't even know if I have room for candy. Like it's just going to be a bunch of toys and stuffies. And these kids are going to have an amazing Easter. I'm super excited. And then I also am going to be having a toy drive. And the great thing is I got a sponsor for band shoes for the kids at the toy drive. So I'm super excited and they agreed to do a larger park. So I am so excited about this year's toy drives that'll be coming up in the beginning of December. So that is always super exciting. And guys, if you um, didn't see me post a lot this weekend, I just want to apologize for that. I usually try to post every single day. And if I don't post that day, I'll post the next day. But I had an event on Saturday. And as you guys know, I've been dealing with some health issues like my blood pressure, iron levels, and my energy is just, it's not where it should be. And so I'm just exhausted after an event and I just could not muster up the energy to do a video and I apologize for that but I know a lot of you guys who watch my channel know I've been trying to really get a handle on my blood pressure. Um, I did do an iron infusion. I got a B12 shot and I felt great but I think I overdid it and by um, Saturday after the event I literally slept the rest of the night and then Sunday I was just I went to um Noah's ROTC graduation, like he graduated from leadership camp. So we went and celebrated that. And by the time that was done, because it was hot and was sitting in the sun, I didn't bring any water. I didn't expect um, that graduation to have like no shade. So um, it was hot, it was sweating. Um, I was dehydrated and then when I got home, I just crashed. So I'm still just trying to get a handle on that. I do go back to the doctor in a couple of weeks just to check everything. I feel a lot better today. I think I just, and the doctor told me I need to slow down a little bit and I can't seem to get a handle on that because I'm always like committing myself to stuff. So I'm trying, I'm trying to get it together. I'm working really hard at just trying to say no to people and just try to just focus on what I have going on. But I know December is just going to explode. So I'm trying to get a handle on this before toy drives hit. And look at her, stalker. And the last thing I definitely wanted to share with you guys, and it's back there. So let me grab that and I'll be right back. So Rite Aid's summer merchandise did hit 90% off and Megan did pick me up this light up cornhole. And I've gotten this before. I found it actually at CVS before in the past. This was $49.99, guys, but it was 90% off. So Megan grabbed it for $4.99. I'm going to use this as a um, raffle gift. I am having an event on November 4th for the um, to celebrate Veterans Day. And um, I'm going to do all the raffle prizes. They asked if I would do them because they've been seeing all the nice ones I've been making for bike night. And like, oh, can you do all the raffle prizes for November 4th? And I'm like... At first I was gonna say no, I think that's a little much, but I'm not doing raffle prizes for October and I've already finished the ones for my bike night. Uh, I think it's every second Friday, I think, I know it's every second Friday of the month and um, it's coming up, but I'm done for, with those raffle gifts. So I said I'd do it and I'm just gonna do like one a day and then hopefully get to where I need to be by November 4th. I got a whole month, I can do it. And I also got some stuff from the 99, so I'm gonna go ahead and flip this camera around. It's a little bit of a bigger haul, so you guys can see everything I got at the 99. I was going to make a couple of raffle gifts, but I got some stuff from the 99. If you saw my 99 shop with me, you know, I recently went to the 99 cent store and I was a little bit like a chatterbox. I just couldn't, yeah, I was talking to you guys a lot. So if you have not checked that video, I'll link it at the end of the video. Lots of great new finds at the 99. Okay, so I wanted to do um, a haul these finds for you guys um i don't know where i'm gonna put this i might put this in a clearance hall i'm just gonna record the footage and then work on my um gifts okay so the first thing i got and this is actually for my next halloween 
themed subscriber gift because my next one, the one I have going on currently while I'm filming this is the pumpkin, but then I am going to do the ghost. So that'll be my next one. So I grabbed this uh, window clings for 99 cents. It's for you guys. And then I also went ahead and grabbed the boo to you little tabletop decor because I just thought it was so cute. It'll go perfectly. And this was also 99 cents. So I grabbed that. I guess I can put these like no room. Okay. I'm gonna put these right here for right now. Okay, next thing I grabbed, and if you saw my video, I was like, I don't need any more doggy clothes. I literally just went through mine and didn't throw a bunch away. I gave a bunch to um, another guy. He has a small chihuahua, like a super cute chihuahua, and he puts clothes on his chihuahua. I know. And he's a guy, too. He's an older guy. And so I was like, I have a bag of clothes that my dogs, they, they were their puppy clothes, like when they were babies. So I ended up giving him like a huge like shopping bag full like not a regular shop not like one of these but like a reusable bag full of doggy clothes so he was super excited. So I got rid of a lot of stuff but I still kept a lot but I could not resist getting this because it's glow in the dark. So this is going to be for Miss Lady. It glows in the dark. It says spooky all day $1.99. It'll look cute on Harley too like they both wear the same size so got that and then they had and these and I was so excited about these so I got a set for Amanda for her um stocking for Christmas and then I got a set for you guys because I figured I'll do something with them so for Amanda I only grabbed three brushes because she doesn't use she uses a lot of sponges rather than the brushes so I got her a blush brush a contour brush and a powder brush in the white I think she'll like that and then for you guys I got three brushes as well the blush brush the powder brush and the contour brush I'm keeping this lipstick brush because I need it and I I'm obs I'm not obsessed with Paul Frank but it just brings back so many memories of when Amanda was a kid because she still love 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 Paul Frank so grab these and these were only 99 cents guys it was a great deal on those so I grabbed those and then um the next thing I grabbed Soil Love was on a um price drop for 99 cents so I grabbed that I actually used about two tablespoons of the Soil Love mixed in with my carpet cleaner and I'm telling you guys magic worked magic took so many you know like um like the hallway, you know, so much foot traffic. It took a bunch of stains away. My mother-in-law be dropping coffee and she says she doesn't, but she can't really see. And she takes her coffee from the kitchen to her bedroom. And that pathway is carpet and <laughs> she drops coffee. Um, I don't say anything anymore. Just let it be. And then I clean the carpets when she goes on her gambling trip or something. When she's going to be gone all day, then I'll do the carpets. If not, I have to do it late at night when she's sleeping because that woman will not stay in her room for me to do it. Okay. These were 99 cents. I thought that was a great de deal. These are the Lavazza um, or Classic. This is the Organic Classic Cold Brew. My husband loves, loves, loves coffee. So I got him one of those. And then I got the Nitro Cold cold Brew for him as well. I'll put these in his, um, bre not breakfast, but his to-go cup. Okay, so I grabbed those. And then I also grabbed some M&Ms because I'm going to be doing an M&M themed type little gift for, I think I'm going to do it for the bingo people. I'm not sure. So I have a bag of M&Ms and two boxes and then one of these like I call it to-go packs of M&Ms so I got a cute little gift in mind so hopefully it will look super cute I don't know but I did grab if you saw that walkthrough I did grab the cups and the cup 3d cup sets were 50% off I didn't even notice that so $4.99 and then on this side was a 50% off tag so I kind of scored on this I got this for $2.49 that's less than a dollar Let's see. Yeah, it's less than a dollar a cup. So I didn't think that was a bad deal for those as well. I was actually going to pay the $4.99. Like I was okay with that. Okay, next thing I grabbed was I went ahead and grabbed the Minecraft blanket. Now these are on price drop for $4.99. The reason why I grabbed it is because my godson is totally into Minecraft, like absolutely loves it. So Minecraft, Roblox, and Legos. So this will be part of his... Christmas gift if I can get it to let's put it right there hey it kind of worked out because I had all, like my Halloween stuff here for um subscriber gifts I had it all like all displayed that's why this is like looking like that okay next thing I grabbed 
can't believe I grabbed so much at the 99. Oh, this is the last thing I grabbed. Okay, the last thing I grabbed at the 99 were these a sharper image memory foam slippers. I got them in a large because I'm going to use these um, for... I think I'm going to use it for the bingo. They were $3.99. I think that is a great deal for $3.99. So I went ahead and grabbed those as well. So that is everything I got at the 99 cent only store. I spent $32. I didn't think that was too bad. I got a, quite a bit of stuff for $32. Bucks, so I was excited. And yeah, guys, that's everything I got at the 99 well guys that is everything that i got at various stores 90 percent um super cheap or super inexpensive a great haul this week i love clarence hunting you guys know that is my jam it helps me help other people and it stretches my dollars so much and i hope it gave you guys some ideas on what you can go out and try to look for look for those red tags look for those yellow tags look at the end clap end caps because those always have the best best clearance deal and if you have a 99 locally by you look for those price drop stickers that's a big one they always price drop every monday and wednesday so i hope you guys are having a fabulous blessed day now don't forget i do have um several subscriber prizes up for grabs i will be announcing the winner of my dollar tree haul um halloween subscriber gift that video is coming up next and then i have my dollar tree shop with me that video is still up on wednesday i'll be announcing the winner every wednesday i do post a new dollar tree shop with me and every wednesday there's always some type of amazing amazing subscriber gift so don't forget to check those videos out the one on wednesday subscriber gift i am obsessed with it's like that old town halloween like pumpkin so if you love halloween i love halloween too i just don't decorate this is my opportunity to do it for you guys and look i actually got my little christmas stuff up because there's no way i'm gonna do fall and christmas it just gets way too hectic so i did take my time and do a little christmas stuff up there i can't wait to start um changing the date on that santa on those snowman because it's like 25 days till christmas so wrong i think it's like 91 days till christmas can you believe it anyways i am going on and on and on i hope you guys are having a fabulous blessed day thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos and remember if you like these videos please remember to like subscribe hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode and i I'm going to be talking to you guys soon. I'm going to be doing my Dollar Tree haul. That one is coming up next. And yeah, you guys stay blessed. Once again, thank you all so much for your love and support. I would not be here without you guys. It's truly, truly appreciated. Each and every single one of you that are liking, subscribing, and watching these videos, especially those commercials, those help the most. Thank you all so, so much. You guys stay blessed.